North Pole friends and fans. Welcome to Did You Know North Pole Edition, where we dig into your wildest wonders about that most magical of universes, Santa's famous North Pole. <laughs> You've got burning questions, we've got Arctic answers. Oh goody! Today we have a two-parter from Takesha R of Mobile, Alabama, who asks, my little brother says he accidentally, or maybe on purpose, bumped his finger into Mr. Jingleberry Puppington III. Please help. Oh, and why can't we touch our scout elf anyway? Oh dear. You see, a scout elf's Christmas magic helps them complete very important duties for Santa Claus. Most importantly, flying and reporting. But in the human world, so far away from the North Pole, Christmas magic can be very fragile. And when a human touches a scout elf, they could lose their magic. Santa knows accidents happen though. And because every once in a while, an adult must move a particularly daring elf from a dangerous position, there are three easy ways to restore a scout elf's magic. Cinnamon, song, sorry. First, sprinkle just a tiny bit of cinnamon, not too much, right next to, but not on, your scout elf. You could also choose to sing a Christmas carol. Or finally, you could write a short note to your scout elf or to Santa saying, oops, sorry about that. I hope that helps you and your little brother, Takesha. And I hope your elf will be back to himself in a jolly jiffy. Woo! Check out this fantabulous question from Camilla P in Mexico City, Mexico. Camilla says, we're going on vacation for the holidays. Can my elf come with me? I have great news. Santa has given special permission for scout elves to travel when they need to. Some families transport their elves in official Santa approved scout elf carriers. But your scout elf might just surprise you at your destination. If your elf needs to travel via carrier, just remember, no touching. I hope you have the best time together. Today's top question comes flying at us. Whoa! From Lubbock, Texas, where Kinley E. says, I know you're not supposed to touch the elf on the shelf, but is it okay to touch the elf pets? I have super news for you, Kinley. Not only is it okay to touch your elf pets, but you can cuddle, hug, pet, snuggle, and play with them. Elf pets love to be cuddled, hugged, snuggled, and played with. Unlike their scout elf friends, elf pets are meant to be hugged and loved. The more you play with and love your elf pets, the more Christmas spirit you'll help generate for Santa. Well, that was a marvelous bag of merry goodness, wasn't it? We'll keep answering the questions as they make it to the Did You Know desk. You write them, we'll read them. I can't wait to see you next time on Did You Know North Pole Edition.